Hi, I'm Dr. Devmita Datta. I'm a parenting consultant and the founder of the website whatparentsask.com, a website that gives expert answers to parenting questions. So one of the commonest questions that parents ask me on my website is, how do I get my child to eat a full meal? What they mean when they ask this is, how do I get my child to eat dal, roti and sabzi in the same meal? And this is the question I'm answering today with my recipe of dal sabji mini paratha. This is one of my favorite recipes because with this recipe, there's no need to beg the child to finish the dal or finish the sabji because the dal and sabji are part of each bite of the paratha. And as your child eats the paratha, the dal and sabji are automatically in his tummy. Let's take a look at the ingredients that we're going to use in this recipe. A few details about the ingredients. The base of the paratha is whole wheat flour or regular atta. The vegetables I've used here are pumpkin and loki or bottle gourd. I've grated them and steamed them with a few drops of water. The dals I've used here are the whole moong and the whole masoor dal because they're rich in both nutrients and fiber. To make the dals, I've taken half cup whole moong dal and half cup whole masoor dal and soaked them overnight and then pressure cooked them together for 30 minutes. To make the parathas, take whole wheat flour in a bowl, add a pinch of salt, add the steamed and grated vegetables, add the cooked dals, Mix in all the ingredients and make a dough without adding any extra water. Roll the dough into thick rotis and cut them into various shapes using cookie cutters. This makes it very interesting. It also keeps the size of the rotis really small and not intimidating. Fry the parathas with a little bit of oil on both sides and then serve them with raita or curd or just like that by themselves without anything else. This recipe turns a full meal into non-messy finger food so children can just pick it up and eat it on the go. This is a recipe that is sure to become one of your favorites because one, it will end your mealtime struggle with your child. You won't have to go on begging your child to finish the dal or to finish the roti. Two, your child will love it because it's so small so it, it's over in a few bites and he doesn't have to take time away from his play and get into eating a whole meal. Three, you will be able to deliver all the nutrients in a small bite-sized meal. You can pack this for tiffin because it's not messy and you can also carry it when you travel with great ease. Also, the adults in your family will like this paratha as much as the kids do. So you won't have to spend double the amount of time cooking different things for adults and for kids in your family. Everyone can be served the same thing and everyone will just gobble it up and devour it. So it's an easy recipe. Make it today and tell me how you liked it. I look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.